how I feel being a parent. Tell your mama how I feel being a parent. And I'll tell you how I felt when I was a parent. Girl, when she first got here, it was pure anxiety. She's thinking about all the stuff that could possibly happen as they get older. Now it's more of a joyous anxiety. It's still anxiety. We still think about them being 16 years old. Her getting more pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> Her doing random stuff, like getting in trouble. You know, like when I became an adult, that's when I finally went to jail. <laughs> <laughs> you afraid you're gonna be the same thing? Yeah, it's almost like no matter how good you, no matter how good you are as a parent, how much you teach them or show them that stuff ain't the way, it's still kind of. Just being a parent is being a parent. Ain't nothing you can really do. You just have to let, let them make their own wide decisions. And grow up. And grow up. They gotta get slapped in the head. You always hear people say, if I was. 16 and I know what I do now. You wouldn't do nothing because you were 16 and you didn't know. It also makes you check yourself or look at yourself and be like, do I think you're going to have to hurt? Yeah, because I do. <laughs> <laughs> it's funny to me. I think the terrible too is the funniest thing we're going to work with for a while. And I think the hardest part about being a parent for me right now is trying to figure out what I'm doing right and what I'm doing wrong. Ain't no right wrong. Yeah, like what's traumatizing or what's not traumatizing. Ain't no right wrong. You need trauma. You get what it taught you. I ain't gonna do that no more. Cause I put out that dog house. <laughs> and now I gotta go to the emergency room. Or uh, I fail and that and my most course was there, but you can't stop all stuff but trauma is needed. My teacher listen, no matter what you think you think it's a bad lesson or a good lesson. Even if you know the lesson already, you still gonna do it again because you think you're gonna get a different result. They are gonna teach you again. Don't jump on my bed. What's she gonna do? She jump on my bed every day. Every day. I also been doing therapy on YouTube. And what happened? And then just connecting some dots that I was not feeling right with. Yeah. Like you know, just being because. It's not just being a parent, it's like being a man or a grown, you know, like, it's not like a rite of passage to being a man, it's kind of like, one day you kid at your mom's house, and the next day you... See, but you are a better man, man because you're here. You don't say you're here for your child. Yeah. You could be one of them and it ain't there. Yeah. If you always think parents and you always think, oh, whatever, what they going to do as long as you can be. Cause I'm overthinking Belgium right now. Cause it's still like if I miss one day I tell him to sit or one day I'm not getting him treats or. And that's a parent of a dog. <laughs> parent <laughs> of a toddler and a dog. One day you can mess up your whole life. <laughs> just not by telling him. One, one day no discipline, just feel like it just do. Ain't no right or wrong in parenting. Ain't no book can tell you about parenting. You learn as you go. Each child different, each personality different.